Do -do -do. Hey there everyone, this is Alki Yao and welcome here to the 9th door contest. The 2011 contest by 1UPS. 1UPS, uh, uh, 69th place with a honeyed 40.25 points out of 60. He got a quarter of a point better than the guy from yesterday. 1UPS though, I reckon his levels aren't like that difficult or something. Unless I'm mixing up with someone else, a lot of peoples on Sumerall Central that have names related to the vocabulary of the Marios, and sometimes can be kind of get difficult a little bit to make the difference between when you're, whoa, this is like Lava Town, Lava Town, Lava 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 Town. Okay, and we got Mario 3 music for some reason, and another fine fella that makes me play through the castle. Yep. But this time there's a bonus, see there's door number 8, see, it says 8 there. But oh no, there's a bridge, and it leads to door number 9, so which it's, it's just kind of more annoying, I guess, I don't know. Door number 9, we're now got his thing, we got a big old slab of land, this seems to be a very wide level. Wide load something. <laughs> Okay, let's take our time here in this wide, empty, well, empty, it's very dark and forbidding and gotta bounce on a little revolving spike thing. Okay, hey there, Mr. Appearing One Up, how's it going? Oh, cannons are scary in the right time of year. So, we're just going to take a careful approach. <laughs> oh, this is perfect. <laughs> if you don't well, know why I find this funny, you, um... You should watch videos <laughs> earlier of this series. Okay, whatever. In 68th place, we got Mario's hat with the ravishing 40.5 out of 60, the room number 9. So this guy is also a quarter point better than the very, very short and empty level we just did. <laughs> Oh, this time we got a reason to re-explore Bowser's castle. It's for finding out a hidden treasure in a room that may be secret. Look at that. Secret castle room. Fair enough. Okay. That works. Bowser did some redecorating and he replaced his castle by a ghost house. Okay. That's gonna hurt me. Now, I know you don't got a lot of points because you missed the point, like a lot of peeps. But, man, do I want to play this level in the context where it makes sense. I don't know, as of now already, this is really, really nice and impressive. Kind of worried, though. <laughs> Yeah, it's just too bad that it's on the wrong context, because wow, uh, that's a dangerous dude. And he may have an attitude. Yeah, okay, um, <laughs> I think that if, if your room has four rooms to it, there might be a problem. Just putting that out there. Okay, okay, got, we got, you're actually a football, but you're like invincible football. The world's most invincible football. Quite a delicious meal. There's a door here. This is so wrong, but so right. I feel like I'm in a very terrible movie saying that. Whoa, what's going on here? <laughs> Am I supposed to go in the other direction? Or is there like a hidden door or something? I don't know. Maybe it's a kill room. Let's kill the room. Or at least the inhabitants within. Oh! And that starts an auto scroll. That's also imp is that made of swamps? That's what? That's crazy town. <laughs> this is way awesome. Um, I am like legit. Ex 
um, expressed. I'm legit express. Your solution for package moving arounding. Uh, I'm legit impressed. Although it's kind of dumb that he gave me a feather super easily when that completely destroys the challenge. Like, the challenge here would be fine without a K, but I'm going to be using that K because he gave it to me, but, uh, you know. Oh, wait, I don't have to kill all the dudes anymore. <laughs> I guess not. I can just enter a door instead. So, was that a room, or was that just a part of a room? That question doesn't make any sense. What am I talking about? The ninja's excited. We got little fragments of magic serving as decoration, which is cute as hell. Wait, was that a... Oh, no. I'm gonna use the shell instead. And you can't stop me now, Mr. Badger Man, yo! I got a cape and it's... Ah, what's going on with the scroll? Oh my god, that... <laughs> it's like when a round tower or something. That is, oh, got the Yoshi Cookie Zeus brown, the horizontal, vertical... Diagonal simulator, that's words, makes no sense. Vertical auto scrolling, and come on, no cow. Yeah, the mushroom, the graphic of the mushroom was changed, which is, you know. Man, this is really detailed and a lot of work. Either dude is a machine at hacking, or he had a lot of this, like, pre installed somewhere and ready to go. Oh, and there's a million coins. <laughs> oh, man! That was an awesome level. Playing a quote-unquote normal hack, I'd have been super mega happy. In the context of this level, completely, of this context, it completely misses the point. Which is super unfortunate, because that was neat. Oh man, this video is such a contrast with the other ones. And by saying this, I just ruined it, haven't I? Zero X came by on 67th place with a mouthful 40.75 points out of 60. <laughs> oh man, we're all within the 40 range here, it's it's amazing. <laughs> Zero X, we don't have any hub. I get the feeling this is another uh, hack that lost a lot of points for, again, missing the point. Um, doing something a bit too chocolatey. A bit to, oh, the death court in the middle of the sea? This is... This. Again? What I want to say here is that I would have been... What? What? Oh, I thought it was that, but he wasn't... It wasn't... Wow, the effect on the skeleton is neat, and the, the, the background is... Neat, the effect, how it doesn't scroll, but with the minimal color, wow, I am impressed. Again, I would have been like the happiest cabbage patch in the world to play this in a context where it made sense. Because this is nothing less than... That skeleton sometimes doesn't have a head or a body, whichever. That one is missing a piece. Dude has some sprite issues, which is kind of funny, considering... Well, I don't know, I guess this isn't that hard to do, it's just you go in the palettes and you're like, Hello, Mr. Palette, I would like you to be black all over. Hello, I am... I'm not even the... What? <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> okay! Whatever! <laughs> you know what? We got two 65th place, so I think I'm gonna try and put them both in this video. The 65th place got 41 points out of 60, so exactly three quarter of a point better than the, the Zero X video we got the first. This first one here is by Crispy Yoshi. The only way to eat a Yoshi, if you ask me, is if it's so crispy you can play the kazoo. Actually, well I don't know. How does crispiness affect playing a kazoo? This is your essay question for today. So, uh, as of now, we've had a very eclectic mix of offering that was pretty neat. As a whole, we got pretty neat. <laughs> the hell? Well, there's that one door that's not at the right place. It has a brick around it. Is that where I'm supposed to... 
What's going on here? Well, let's go here. Oh, okay, it's a shortcut to this hallway. So I ask, why even bother with this, and why not just make me start at the right place to start with? But okay, whatever. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> Fishing fish guy. We got sealing water. This is, well, at least it's very vanilla. It's not afraid of its vanilla And I got a laser in the face. And now I get to rerun through the hallway again. Because <laughs> that's... That's very the interesting part of the castle experience, so... Oh man, okay, so... We got water and fire, I can live with that. I... I I'm fine with an upside down water when... Oh, no, whoa, 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 look at that time portal I tripped in. Man, that, that, I could have hurt myself there, I'm gonna write... A very bad OSHA report for Bowser here. So, we got Ghost. Bowser Castle, he also got Ghost. He got Koopas, got Skeletons, got Robot. Fishing Fish Guy. Dude, that's been that's used exactly once in the original game, so it wouldn't make sense to maybe see an Encore in the castle. Although, this is going to be tricky. Mr. Laser. You shine so bright, your ectoplasm flashed on brightly in the night. Dealing with you. <laughs> this is me not paying attention at all. Look at it, this is gonna be really difficult. Ugh! 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 <laughs> Ugh! Oh no! I wanted to uh, scroll the screen, but I don't think it's gonna be feasible here, but I'm afraid of an eerie surprise. And not in the sense that the surprise is gonna be frightening, but in the sense that Eerie is the name of an enemy in this video game. It's those guys. There's a five pack, right? How am I gonna go there? Fishing fish guy, I'm gonna ask you, please, is the flame ever gonna hit me there? I don't... I don't think so. Let's not take a chance! And let us make it through! And I'm at the end! Yeah! The other 65th place is Raindrop Die with another 41.60 out of... 41 point out of 60. Oh, I'm, I'm so afraid of decimals, it's completely screwed me up. Anyway, Raindrop Die, so here we got an exact comparative to make. But he found the ninth door! Oh man, that's crazy town. And it's on top of the tower. Top of this top secret area. No wonder he never found top secret. Whoa, this. I got like super huge. Uh, Smith Swindle production. Central production here vibe because of that one. That one house I kept returning to in order to farm for lives, basically. <laughs> okay, okay. We got reverse dry bones. I can actually believe that like that's a sort of gimmick that Nintendo would um, invent for a room sort of like the equivalent of the carpet maze and whatnot you know how and and, and whatnot but uh, I, I'm assuming that's a reset door let's try it out anyways whoa no not quite it's a dragon coin oh boy I'm I got the full-on level vibe here if I think <laughs> So there's a P switch there that I want to use. Do I want to use it? Yes, I do. It's not that I have much of a choice, but how do you get there? Ha! Like that. I don't know. That jump seems scary to my. Okay, so let's see here. Panic. Panic. Oh no, I need to make it there. There's multiple layers of going in the thing. 
Wow, really? So it's a race? Well, I'm playing a legit level here and not a room, but it looks to be a very good quality and seems to be fairly fair in its assessment of difficulty. It's just that it's still like, you know, hard-ish, but not unreasonable about it. I can, you know, it, whoa, it looks pretty pleasant. I'm just gonna, now that I know that it is a, like even more of a race, I know that I gotta hurry up and I don't have time to... Uh, you exactly. Man, what? Wow, okay. You gotta be fast. You gotta go fast. Gotta lose your body and glue your legs to your chin and run at the speed of sound. I won't continue that unless it infringes on someone's uh, personal property. Well, at least I can stay powered up, but, uh... Ugh! You gotta really go fast there. You don't you, you 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 don't have no time for no gruff. So just go 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 Power Rangers doodle doodly do. Come on, come up. Ah! And I bet that's the end too. Is not a reset door, and in fact the exit at the end. Uh, that one dragon coin is really suspicious and makes me one. What? Okay, I'm gonna get the flower. Ugh. Yeah, just got the flower. Oh man, I deserve the glitch, so this game gets penalized. No, it's ridiculous. Ta 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 ta. Whatever. Oh no, that screwed up the music, so I'm gonna kind of just take the hit. <laughs> it's easier. <laughs> and look at where we are now. It's the land before time. It's made of bread or something or another. Wow, today was so fun and so neat and so nice and so ah. Uh, just after I bet the contest scared off, like, a good fifth of the people who would be otherwise interested. Ah, <laughs> oh, well, raindrop dry, no, same basic thing as everyone today, almost. Well, not, not one-ups, but everyone else is... You missed a point. Great level. I'd love to play that level in another context, but you missed the point. Too bad. Honestly, it's this is this is a part that's like too bad. It's the potential is so there.